Hello, Exiles? I guess that's what I'd say. But hey guys, how is everyone doing today? Welcome to the stream. I hope you're all doing very, very well. We are, um, community level kind of free building in Conan, kind of enjoying the, basically the building mechanics that we have in game. Um, so guys, hope you, hopefully uh, this is something you'd be interested in and you're all kind of along for the ride for. Uh, we'll definitely be giving you a go, seeing what happens and all that kind of stuff. And uh, yeah, um, any questions as we go, make sure you ask them. If there's um, any kind of like you'd like to know what I'm doing, um, I am essentially doing admin mode. This is important because it's free building. Uh, this is what you do. You do. Uh, you have to go into admin mode to do it. And all that kind of stuff, uh, but yeah, we're, we're currently my main aim is to rebuild this bridge. Now, the the bridge itself, as you can see, is pretty big and bridge-like, and I decided that it needs to be rebuilt. So this is me rebuilding the bridge. This is what I've done so far. It's an interesting one, um, but yeah, it should be quite a good little bit of fun, at least I hope it will be. We're going to give it a go, like I say, and we'll uh, go from there. You can't completely recreate the original structure, but we will certainly give it a go. But a quick hello to everyone who's in chat so far. So, uh, Philip, how you doing? Hashtag Wiley, chickers. Uh, da -da -da. Um, Butters McLovin, how you doing? Uh, Lee, what up? You need to get yourself into the game, Lee. Hurry up and start playing it. Um, Gary, how you doing? Commander Iman. But yeah, Firefox, hello, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. But yeah, we, we're going to struggle a little bit to get this perfectly lined up. And I would say is something that I really need to make sure that we do. You can see the uh, the block we've got here to make sure it lines up with these blocks here so that when the bridge goes straight out it actually lines up because any small little I guess um, wrong angle if the angle's slightly wrong then um, it means that it won't line up this is going to be a bit of a bit of a tough one to do oh everything's spawning back in I think that's straight. This could be a, a real pain. Hey Hunter, how you doing mate? Oh, I don't know if that's straight. Is that straight? That's not straight. That doesn't look straight. Ugh. Um, well Nightbot, it's not, even, it's not even OCD heaven or hell. This is just that if it doesn't line up, it means the bridge isn't going to hit the other end. I might have uh, started off a little bit rough on this, but yeah. Um, Conan Exiles has a really nice little free build mode in it, which I'm quite a fan of. I think it's um, a rather cool feature they put in. They kind of knew that people would want to build. Is that, that, that. Because also what doesn't help is these bits here over on, like hanging off the end, they uh, don't quite angle up, um, but it's possibly because of it being PlayStation consoles being consoles. Um, right, no, you know what, we're not going to start there. I'm not happy. It's going to be nice. I'm just going to try and get into it. And then once we're off, we're off. As soon as I'm happy with it being straight, we'll have our beginning of the great building. Uh, we'll start further back. Because you only, you only have to line up one side, and then we're all good. But yeah, how, how's everyone's week been? See, we're, we're sat here. It's a Friday evening. Um, everyone good? I kind of oh, this is right pain in the backside. This is okay. Because what I want to do is. The flying movement is playing havoc with me because I can't move forward. There. 
Yeah, that's straight. Yeah. Except it's not. Oh, <laughs> no. So, Lee, you've been busy. Um, oh, yeah, Butters. It's, um, I mean, it, if you got it for free, you're wicked. That is really cool. Um, I tried to convince uh, Commander Scorbius to, uh, to play it. He's like, oh, I don't like PvP. I don't like raiding. It's like, well, you don't have to do those bits. You can play on your own. And there's a lot to do. Right. Okay. And we're gonna... No. It's a me... Oh, God. It'd be cool if you could move stuff once it's really been placed. Um, well, here's the thing, um, Philip, is that you once you start building, it all clicks together, uh, and it does. It, it's um, you kind of have that that focus, and it, it once you start building, you're all good. Um, oh, when I was doing a weird thing, where, where, let me delete these bits. Right, we're gonna come back to them. Because even if you line up to one of them, I mean, I could line up this way instead, I guess. And the thing is, I, I where I've already built that bridge down that end. And my problem is, is that I tried to. I thought, oh no, I'll just line it directly up. And then I realised I haven't actually lined up the uh, the bridge at all, which is a bit of a mistake. Come on, let me delete these bits now. Don't do this to me. <coughs> now, come on. Come on, we're, we're, we're definitely close enough to it. Man, let's give you one of these. One of these, Dave. Right, we'll come back to it. Because part of me is like, I oh, know, just comp just 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 build, man. Just just build it, and you'll see what happens. But nope. Um, oh, butters, I did not build the whole bridge. Um, I I built, I've I patched one gap already. Um, there's still plenty to be done. Gee, we might be able to remove it from the underside, which no, no, we can't. Oh no. Oh no, yeah, <laughs> nipple cat. <laughs> yeah, that's the reason why I chose chose a male character. I guess that would be uh, getting trouble from a certain certain crowd. Hmm. Right. Now we kind of have to ignore that. Just try and line this one up. It's not straight. Immediately, you can tell it's not straight. Or is it? No, it's not. Oh. I can't delete this piece. Right. We're going to be cool about it. And we're just going to go over to the other side of the bridge and see if we have better luck. This seemed like a great idea at the time. I was like, yeah, I'll do this, I'll do that. I'll do, um, I'll do some awesome free building. We'll give that a go. Um, and that's something that's actually missing from the the online game, I'll say, is that when, when you're playing with other people, it doesn't tell you when you've entered their territory. And I think that'd be a bit nice if it did. I mean, that looks fairly straight, doesn't it? I think... I think we're off. Yeah, we're off. We're doing it. Okay. I'll get these put in. But yeah, the unlimited build mode is pretty handy. It's going to... Uh, it's quite nice for practicing, so you can come on to a, basically a solo game. 
and then you can uh, come get into it. Um, Nightbot, I've never really played Minecraft. That's the problem. Uh, so I don't have any Minecraft training. Come on. But yeah, we'll have to get creative in a minute. It starts off nice and easy with your old buildy buildy, but then because symmetry is quite important with this, at least it is to me, it that there is a tiny little bit of ACD involved, I guess you could say. Right. We don't because I kind of want everything to go in a same kind of shape. So it means that when you're building things stay easy. Easy to kind of work out where things should be. That's the idea behind it. So yeah, we'll give ourselves kind of like a key, I guess, to work from. Um, Butters, that's totally fine, man. You, you won't find anyone hating on you here. Uh, what, one thing I'll say is with um, No Man's Sky is that I just found it very boring. Unfortunately, as far as games go, I wasn't didn't really enjoy it that much. Uh, it just wasn't for me, which is fine. You know, it's everyone has different tastes, so that is okay. Okay, right. We need to build straight down from here, though. I want to build out as far as I can with these. Because that way I know roughly where to start building down. Uh, I'm going to use the existing bridge structure as kind of a a bit of a a guess, a guess, bit of big bit of guesswork where things should be. Because uh, I only have to come down to this existing structure here in order to keep the bridge going. And the fact is that it's um, directly underneath. So I guess we'll drop it straight down. This could be alright. I'm, I'm feeling. I'm suddenly feeling positive about it all. We'll give it a go. But yeah, there, there is a big update coming for No Man's Sky. Uh, no Man's Sky, um, pretty original name, because um, no games out there are called this at all. Um, no Man's Sky Beyond. Um, spot sarcasm there for you. Because Elite Dangerous Beyond is a thing. But yeah, VR support, which should be interesting. I think that'd be. One of the things that I like in VR, uh, VR gaming, is that you kind of go, you could go one of two directions with that. So either you go super duper realism, all out, or you go for that peculiar realism kind of things. You know, that that uh, surrealness, but super immersive. And I'm hoping that's the direction that No Man's Sky will go. And then that way should be uh, should be pretty cool. All right, we'll get rid of this now. Uh, I will mention that I only have one mod installed. Lost building, and this is for people that are all all about that and want to know. The one mod that I have installed is just cool. Is basically just reduces the amount of building restrictions that you have, and that means that I can build in some places that you wouldn't necessarily be able to build in. But there's nothing that should be too standoutish, I guess. Now, what I really should be doing is putting these here, rather than uh, I should. Mm, yeah, I, I'm. This isn't going to fit in otherwise. So we need to we need to do some rather brutal. Some rather brutal things in order to make this work because it shouldn't really be here. Because what I've done on the other side, I've got to try and make it make it match. Um, chickas, yeah, it does. Uh, at least it did when I built it. As you can see, what I've done. Oh, have I done that? Yeah, so we've got flat ceiling tiles across and then for chunks of it. Yeah, I need to make sure I do it that way. Um, but as funny enough, that is that is one of my plans. Once When I get good enough at it, I will give it a go. And um, there's an also... 
there's a, a couple of things that other things that I'd like to build as well. I've always fancied trying to give the the Tower of London a go, the uh, the White Tower, because I, I figured that would be pretty easy to do. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of this. Uh, has tight gish you can you can build into the water because I'm gonna need to. The only thing is, is that you can't breathe underwater without a potion. So you could potentially do yourself a um, an underwater base and make it so that the only way to access it is to have a breathing potion, which could be a bit of a, an interesting one. But there are some things that you can't place underwater, like you can't place a campfire underwater, which sounds kind of obvious. But, but at the same time, it's it's not that obvious. Okay, so from here, we can't build any further out just using these ceiling tiles. So again, we're going to build straight down. Uh, with these posts. And this time we will be building straight all the way down into the water. Because we don't have to build directly underneath the bits like what we can't build. All we need to do is create a pillar that will allow us to then build. I don't need to go one more down. There we go. Oh yeah, I can I can still that's what I can still drown even though I'm using app in mode. Uh chickers I have not tried the chair trick. Uh, but I don't really need to, so it's alright. Um Oh well, guess we'll drown. I think we'll come out to here. But yeah, underwater bases, I, I think they're a really cool idea, or at least having them on the water. I'm a big fan of that. Oh! That's interesting. Once you're swimming, you are no longer flying. <laughs> there we go. But yeah, the, the glitch Chickas is talking about, um, which is definitely uh, definitely fixed on live, was where if you put a chair down underwater and sat down on the chair, you could then walk around underwater rather than having to swim, and you wouldn't drown. Which, as you can imagine, people exploited the absolute hell out of. Because there are some places in the game where you can only get certain things underground, oh, underwater. But yeah, definitely not a fan of that on PvP servers, glitching and all that kind of stuff. As you guys know, I'm highly against that. Okay, so the reason why we haven't had to build directly next is because we can build ceiling tiles off of this. And we don't want to go completely... Uh, if we get to the other end and it doesn't line up perfectly, I'm going to be pretty distraught. Perfect, perfect. There we go, nice. Uh, yeah, one other thing this mod adds is it gives you directions on everything, direction arrows, so you know exactly which way the front of everything is, which doesn't make a lot of sense for ceiling tiles and foundations. No. But, it, I mean, this looks like it's lining up. And then we can do the same again, we'll build straight down, put another pillar in. Um, I say buses with what I'm playing on is that it's uh, I've got a, basically unlimited building pieces, so it's totally fine. Um, but otherwise, what you have to do is you have to go and find it. You have to do your crafting, and um, it's all about that. It's a survival game, isn't it? So you've got to put the effort in. You kind of you you get the sticking point when you're when you're building between iron and steel. So you get different tiers of building, tiers 1, 2, and 3, and you get the sticking point where you're kind of 
typically I skip tier 2 stuff and just move straight into tier 3 because tier 3 is e well it's kind of I guess self propagating so the more you get the easier it becomes if that makes sense because it increase because it comes with them um, as you build you gain more and more and more of everything uh, put me all fly mode back in um right so oh Gary have fun man um enjoy the film but yeah um, until I've built up to the top um Lee it won't it won't stay standing so I have to make sure that I've put the reinforcements in first otherwise it won't won't stay standing but yeah like I say I'm nervous about whether or not this is going to perfectly line up but I think what I'm going to do on my uh, solo play going forward is I'll probably give this another stream another time as well and I will continue to attempt to rebuild the exiled lands because there are a couple of other bridges to give a go of or aqueducts there are to do Build it to the top. Oh, oh, I made a mistake there, really. Um, I should have built further over. Oh, well. I've just made it slightly more hard work for myself. But that's fine. Um, no, Bus is totally, um, Totally fine, man. Um, I like it. Uh, I particularly enjoy the, the like I say that the PvP and the raiding side of things. Um, Chickas will tell you that. Um, he'll tell you how bloodthirsty I am and how it has gotten me in trouble a couple of times uh, whilst playing games. But that is indeed the uh, the name of the game. With you know, PvP servers is to you know, build, dominate, fight, and all that kind of stuff. The one thing they really should think about doing is having servers where they regularly wipe. Because I think that would be that'd be better to do. Just a bit like in any other games of similar genres. Okay, wasn't sure if that had got in there. So yeah, we're going to try and get this right this time. Uh, we're not going to build in exactly the same spot. We're going to build slightly further over there. Um, hmm. If I've got a spot I can't build in, why can't I build there? So the building can be a little bit peculiar sometimes. This is one of these examples of it. Oh, there we go. Okay, time to fly again. And this is something you can do. I'm not sure if it's on console. with the build mode, but the building works exactly the same. The loading times can be a little bit rough uh, because a lot of it relies on the network. And you remember, it's all real-time building for everybody and other people and stuff. But I, I can't be hearing stuff like that. Everything you should be lined up. Uh, it looks looks pretty lined up. Um, hey, Alien Hunter. Uh, I'm doing some building today, mate. Just I'm um, just doing some uh, casual building in Conan Exiles. Um, I'm rebuilding the exiled lands. That's kind of my plan. Is I'm gonna try and rebuild any damaged structures that I can come across in the game. Uh, we're doing the bridge. The sl well, it's part of the slaveway. Hey, I mean, look at that. It's it's close. It's close, but that lines up. It's going to be fine. Uh, 
Um, oh no. Oh, I have made a mistake. Came too far over. So, when stuff like this happens, and you make a bit of a, a balls up, you, you, you got to fix it somehow. And I already know what I've got to do. Uh, has tech? No, no, you can't. You can't do that. You can't dam the down the river, unfortunately. Now, uh, oh, mistakes. Very kind of you to say night, but we we haven't finished it yet, though, have we? Uh, I need to get rid of these bits here. Because what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna need to put I need to put another another row in, which is a bit of a pain. Because of those two bits there that don't line up. Uh, but yeah, hunter um not hunter, sorry, chickens. Um do you need to make a, a Colosseum type thing? That seems to be quite a common thing on PvP servers, people make Colosseums and you you know they they fight on them. Uh, supports and the foundations that might do it. I don't know if they work. I don't know if they actually work. What are they called? Um, called like wooden, wooden something. So many building pieces gives everyone an idea of what we're dealing with here. Is it reinforcement? Is that what it's called? Oh, but unfortunately there are no mounts in it, so you, you can't actually you can't actually ride around on animals, which is a bit of a shame. But it's um, it was something that was going to be put in the game, but then wasn't later on, and that's due to. Uh, I used console actually. So I've been playing this since early access, since it first started, and everything was slightly different. Let's see, it'll be somewhere. It'll be somewhere in here, won't it? The thing that I'm looking for. They get rid of it. I thought they were only decorative. I thought they were only decorative. Oh, struts, beam, decorative. Yeah, it's decorative. So we'll give it a go. Although I'm not convinced. Yeah, they don't even reach. Um, oh, hang on. What? Yeah, I don't think that's going to do it, chickens. Nope. Nah, that's right. We are going to. Remove these ones here. Plug that back up. And right back down to the bottom we go. Just totally pointless. It's one of those things where it's a bit like, oh, right, okay, well, it's decorative, and it literally is decorative. Although they could have made them so it didn't, that would be interesting. But I guess they couldn't. You reach a certain limit where complexity can. and their support system can only go so far, I guess.
and then that will give us enough to put these in, which should be fine. Uh, so, it looks like we should be able to get away with just doing one final drop. Oh yeah, guys! If you you know if you fancy it, um, do hit the old like button. Uh, it does help me out on the old YouTube's if you fancy it. Okay. Set up a toll booth and get paid. Unfortunately, Buster's people don't. Uh, there isn't any money in Conan. Well, that's not strictly true. That there, there is some things you can purchase in game with coins that you find, and well, I mean that you can make some coins. You can make silver coins, but they're not really worth doing anything with apart from grinding them down and turning them to something else. Saw me, boy. Hello. You're saying, ah, like I've just revealed something, an important thing that you didn't know. business, we've made it all the way to the side, that still lines up just about, it, oh, what happened here? Oh, Nightbot, no, none of that, definitely none of that. Can tell you straight away. I mean, oh, it's not perfect. I right, def definitely not, definitely not perfect. Close, very close. Um, I'm calling it. It pains me to say it. Good, good enough. I mean, it's damn, damn near close. Right. I mean, it, it it's within the that'll do realms, which isn't my favourite place for, <laughs> for things to be. But I guess it will do. It will. I have to put. A bit in here. Yeah. I'll kind of pad out the bottom a little bit on this bit. Just so it blends. It won't, uh, there is literally no way to get it perfect, but we'll do what we can. Okay, big ass bridge. Done. Um, Buster's is saying we need a, need a ramp for wheelchair access. Um, well, I don't think 
there are any wheelchairs kicking around in Conan, so we'll probably probably not have to worry about it. We should be good. Well, these are, I mean, not that I've seen in any of the Conan movies, anyway. Okay. I say, not perfect. But these things seldom are. Uh, Nightbot, yeah, pretty much. I mean, if you were to give something like this a name, would that not be... Oh, would that not be the name that you would pick? Oh, you know, I'll finish that off in a minute. It's Woke Conan. I mean, the level of wokeness is unbelievable. I mean, for for a barbarian. And can you have a woke barbarian, or do they cease to be a barbarian at that point? I'm probably putting too much thought into this. I mean, th this is definitely not in 2019, though. This is Hyborian Age, which is a time after Atlantis sunk into the sea and all that, all that malarkey. I wonder if I can get rid of this one yet. Oh, come on! <laughs> How can I not? Oh. The local council would call it a restoration of the spirit of the original. Yeah, it has tech. I think they would. I think they would. I'm a bit annoyed that I can't get rid of this one. Um, let's change to walking and see if that's the reason for it. If it's the old flying malarkey. It's not. Oh, God. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to have a quick relog. Um, mm, no, we're going to finish building first before we deal with any of that. So, what we're going to do, it's like on that one over there, you can see on the uh, central pillar we put these little structures around it, so I think we will do that to put two of them in, I would say. Yeah, I think we'll put two of them in, so I'll put one in here. Yeah, it could be. That's <laughs> take. You could be right. That might be the only way to do it. Ah, uh, except we can't put one on this one because this one's only four. Why did I do this one's only four? Why would I do that? Definitely balls this up. Mistakes were made. Yeah, mistakes were definitely made. Okay, well, you know what we can do? We can we can be creative. No, but then it won't match. Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna keep saying hmm until. I decide what I'm doing. So, hmm. Tear it down, start again. No freaking way. Besides, I've got some other things I want to build this evening. Oh, 
should have kept that piece out. And give him nice little caps on top. Um, oh god, it makes you wonder, Vortex, why that was someone's bright idea. And it, I guess it's kind of a the reason they've done it is to minimise disruption. But it doesn't feel less than disruptive when it's being described or said out loud. It sounds pretty disruptive, doesn't it? It's like, hey, I've got this great idea. Oh, I go on and pitch it. I went, well, we're going to build a new bridge. I'm like, oh, brilliant, great idea. No, no, I'm not finished yet. Okay. Oh, right. Okay. I went, it's going to be in the exact same place as the old one. I was like, right, right. I went, whilst the old one's still there, and then we're going to slip it over. Okay, would it not be easier just to tear the old one down and then read it? No, 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 no. We can't do that. That would be madness. <laughs> but no, it's a great idea. Um, uh, I, I'm going to assume it's Euroraptor. I'm going to say Euroraptor. But hey, how you doing? Uh, that's me, the butcher of names. Commander Plater, first of his name. Butcher of other people's names. Lord of nothing. First of his name. That's a me. Come on, come on. Get, 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 get out of there. Get, get. There we go. No, come on. There we go. <laughs> Today on hype, yeah, this is this is a problem. So I'm gonna I'm gonna have to do something about. It. I can't I can't do this. I can't, I can't leave this as it is. I've got to. I, I have to do something about it. And um, Ali, hey, how you doing? Welcome to the stream, bud. I mean, see, now you say traffic disruption does cost money. Not to the people doing the roads. In fact, it would save them money unless it's a toll bridge. I think this this should just be enough to prevent any pretend fake internet OCD I have from kicking in. Because liking things just so doesn't necessarily mean you've got OCD. I just think like the thing is to be excessively pleasing. There we go. From a construction point of view, it makes more sense. All right. Um, well, no, but I don't think people actually know, realize that's that's the thing that we do. You need to educate them and ex and explain, <laughs> just so everyone knows. And also, once I finish doing this part of the bridge, I have to go back and essentially finish it off. Yeah, see, see, Nightbot, people don't know. So, so, so I mean, it's more or less finished at this point. It, it's bridge-looking. It's bridge-like. It serves for bridging. I'm gonna put the old little fence topperoos on. That is the technical term. Yeah, it is a bit like I mean I wouldn't have to do that that uh, different looking eye. Wouldn't wouldn't have to do it. Um, 
Now, I I hate to think how much materials it would cost to actually make this. Uh, Chickas knows with the building side of things. Or anyone that plays Conan will know that the the building costs can be a real pain. That's the wrong way. I'm on the wrong way around. But yeah, I didn't think I'd be able to put that there, actually. No, no, we can't put it there. Even if it says we can. It's fine, and then suddenly it's not. Okay. I c it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Um, but yeah, not not night but it, it's the is it's the letter, I think. Okay. Nice. <laughs> well, vortex. Luckily, Kainan has a uh, a basically free build mode, so you can do whatever you like, and it not cost you any materials, which is perfect for something like this, a bit of a project. And now it's not going to matter so much how straight this, this bit is. Although there, there is some, some lore regarding the bridge, the Conan, Conan world. The ancients and stuff, and they they built it as a way for people to pass into the into their land. And apparently, humans were classic humans, and we were just kind of just kind of dicks about the whole thing, um, which we obviously shouldn't have been, but we were. Oh, buses! If you're off, mate, I'll catch you later. Yeah, there's two lore items on the end of each bridge, at each end of the bridge, so it's worth having a little look at. Sure, if we're doing ramp or stairs for this, we're gonna give it a go, and we'll, we'll, we'll make a decision. As a group, we'll make a decision. And that's pretty steep looking. That's pretty steep for a ramp, isn't it? Yeah, we're doing stairs. Decision is already made. I say as a group, we'll make the decision. Nope, I, I'm making an executive decision on this one. Um, could have done both. Could I have done both? What, on top of each other? I mean, I kind of feel like that would have looked rather, rather janky. Because what it is, we'll... Yeah, we'll work that out in a minute. Oh, need to get rid of this one. It's going to cause us problems if we don't. And we will put these in here. Because the stairs will need some support as well. Side by side. Hmm. I mean, I feel like we were kind of joking about the whole wheelchair accessible thing, 
um, just because you know it's it's a freaking game and it doesn't have to be politically correct okay right uh, hey David how you doing welcome to the stream I hope you're having a good evening Doing a bit of free building in Conan this evening. No, 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 happy with that. That's more like it. And we can do the same on this side as well, so that's fine. You kind of get a real, I guess, a real look into the, uh, internal workings of my brain <laughs> when I'm doing this because there is a very I, I guess logical way to everything that I'm doing um, it may not necessarily look it but there definitely is it's important that things do match and line up as much as possible too don't look at that Just, just don't, don't look at the, the abomination that I've created. There, it's fine. Oh, we do that there. Get rid of that. We'll do a little, uh, no, 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 that's not what we're doing. I'm going to put a little, little guard tower on the end. Just, oh, come on with the inside out thing. Make it a one-way bridge. Make his tra <laughs> spike traps at one end. All vortex, I've, I've completely much completed the bridge, so... I mean, I could do that, I guess. Make it a little bit, uh, aggressive. Although, what I should have done, because there are two different types of stairs, is what I should have done. Is there is a type of black ice with rails. Is that one? Oh no, there they are the one. That's not the one with rails. Stone brick stairs, rails. Black ice reinforced rail. Or is that the one? They call him that one with rail. Because that's not got rails. But then they have one where it's no rails. Hang on. That's what we've got already. Yeah, drawbridge at the end. Mm, no, I don't know if that would have worked. I don't think I don't think a drawbridge would have worked uh, because it wouldn't have had anything to drop down onto. But what we can always do, because technically they are coming. In, so they're coming in from this end of the bridge down here. You see, into the lands. So we're gonna change to walking, and we're gonna increase our movement speed. So, that'll do it. Okay. No, no, it didn't. What? What are you doing? What's happening here? Right, there we go. So, run across the bridge. I mean,. <laughs> Now, I will mention that there are these rocks here. These will disappear once the uh, once we kind of log out and log back in again because they're part of the resource spawning.
We could put something big over at this end. That would work. Yeah, right. we'll do that. Uh, and we don't have to be quite as precise now. Because we're doing smaller individual structures, basically. Yeah, we need to be more precise than that, though. And also, I, I don't use the gates very often, so there's going to be a little bit of chopping and changing with this, I think, because, yep, oh no, oh come on, you, no, no, you can do this. I mean that, that, hmm. Hmm. That's not going to work for us, is it? Okay, right, it does need to line up. So we're going to have to remove what we've put in. And this is just as well not everything lines up because this would never work. Because the gate... This is the problem with the gates. The gates are... Uh, they're... Um, not an odd number, but everything else is. So the gate goes in over three. I think the gate goes in three. This is just a te this is just a test. I don't want it to... Yeah, it does. Go to another three. That's fine. Put it the right way around. Actually, we're going to get this more... more centred. And we'll go from there. Now, I'm hoping that you guys are finding this a reasonably relaxing experience. Instead of, you know, you're just kind of casually waiting for me to get something wrong. Which, I mean, it's what I would be doing. Yeah, Nightbot, I thought you might say that. Or something similar. Definitely nothing casual about it. It's like, we're not casually waiting, we're just waiting. Oh, right. to do is put this like along the top. I kind of wanted it to go there instead. I wonder if we move them. I've not done this level of building before. 
Hey, here we go. So yes, we can. It's handy to know. I'm learning so much about building already from this, which is kind of why I'm doing it. I did um. I, I feel like I started to start decide that I actually want to, you know, be good at some games, um, and building is something that people that I watch on YouTube. Um, I'm quite impressed with what they do in Conan, and so I thought, you know what, I'll have me some of that as well. <laughs> Nightfall, for real? Like, for, for, for Rizzle? Oh no, chickens! There's a reason why I don't let you build anything. <laughs> it's kind of it's one of the one of the old um, running jokes. Um, I I know that for example, you've seen you've come across some traps that you're like, oh no, we need to put this in the base. This is how this has to be. I'm like, no, 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 no. But does it look nice? No, oh, excuse me. Aztec is waiting for the barbarian building inspector to turn up. Excuse me, sir. You, you, got, you got a license for that? Like what? Do you, you you got a license for that? Like what? Do you, what do you mean? I'm a barbarian. I don't don't need a license. Do do, do you have one though? Uh, no. Uh, did we? Oh no, just a door. But I didn't put a gate in my inventory. One coordination is the wrong way around. Yeah, it is chick as you're right. I'm trying to think what else you want to put in. So we're doing some really basic square block building, which I mean, to be honest, is not that exciting or complicated, but it's a start. We will build out a little bit further. There we go. Oh, I already had one. Who would have thought? That's all very gate-ish. Hey, ignore the fact that you can climb and you can just go around it. it it's um, a unique offering here in uh, the Oxhard Lands. Uh, we offer a gated community. Need some security well chickers. We we don't want to intimidate people too much on the way in. But we are gonna put some statues in. That that's why I've made those little sections there. Is I wanted to put statues in. Because again, this is something I don't normally put in. Statue of guidance, the King's Good statue. Perfect. That's what we want. A little bit imposing. This looks like our mate Shiv. No, 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 no. Why would why would you even mention the teapots? Why would you why would you do that? Okay.
new guys and the tea thing. It's like I just I just don't like it. I don't hate tea. I I, I don't feel like it all needs to be destroyed or anything. That wouldn't be my go-to reaction. I just don't drink it. It's it's nothing that extreme. Ridiculous. Oh, hey Tane, how you doing? Okay, so come here. We cross the bridge. I think this is all right. This is good. I, I'm I'm almost ready to call this finished. Yeah, chickens. I remember that. Every single time I logged in, you guys would put something on my bed. It was good that. I say, I mean, it wasn't good. It was a massive pain in the backside. But hey, it was like living with a group of friends. Like. Messy friends, but messy warmongering friends, it was. That's what it was like. Like, horse. This is what gets me is that it shows a horse, right? There are no horses in the bloody game. Just want to make sure I'm, I'm happy with it all. Hmm. It's fine. Um, dragon head on the side of the bridge. Mm, possibly chickens. We've gone for structural initially, and then build up the adornments. Adornments, because I feel like you know you've got to stop people crossing the bridge. You wouldn't want to stop people crossing halfway across or anything like that. You'd want to encourage people to keep moving on the bridge. So that's why we've not got any anything at the other end, because, you know, it's a, alright, keep moving, off the bridge, everyone keep going, no rubbernecking. It's just the exiled lands, get a move on, don't stop, keep going on. A trapdoor in the middle. Uh, Tane, if I could put a, a toll booth in, I would, but I was saying earlier that there's no money in Conan. Uh, which is a shame, but yeah, this is four across at the at this end, at the other end, not so much. But yeah, I'm calling this this finished. Um, yeah, and we got about an hour hour to go, so I guess it's going to be next structure, next thing we build. I'm open to suggestions. We've built a bridge so far. Chickers, um, I'm going to assume if I put teapots, um, then yeah, that'd be the thing. Uh, has to, yes, actually, everything is going to be equal. No, the bridge doesn't get wider. It's that one end is, is kind of more more narrow, so the entranceway controls flow and then the rest of it's nice and fast. Although, I'm not... I'm. You know, I'm, I'm right. The time to tinker. I've got to tinker now. Sorry, hang on. This I can't have this. This is this isn't right at all. Um. Oh. Yeah, chickens. I think I was thinking, what's what's next? What, what, what do we want to work on? Um, I just felt like this 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 looks like it needs some support at this end. Um, Anthony, no, no, I don't. The the um, it'd be like a conveyor belt, or like a slave veyer belt. But yeah, as soon as the tinkering starts, like I'm doing now, it's uh quick, get me away from it. Because what I'll do is I'll ruin it. I'll do, I'll do something stupid that I can't recover from. But yeah, that makes sense. Pyramids. Ooh, pyramids. Alright, okay. 
That I can do. I can definitely do pyramids. Pyramids with an inside. Pyramids with an inside. And I know just the spot to build one as well. So on the map, there are lots of different places where you can build. I'm thinking over here. So one of the joys of, of uh, playing privately means that you can teleport yourself around. Um, oh no, this is the wrong spot. I didn't mean here at all. I want over here. Big wide open space. Don't know how I discovered the southern aqueduct, which is here. That might need rebuild. No, right. There's a bit up here that definitely needs rebuilding, which we will keep going. And um, Haztec, unfortunately, not possible. But yeah, look at this. We have a big wide open area to quote Paroxim. We're going to pick a corner of this, of this wide open area. I thought physics be damned. Damn it, man. I'm a barbarian, not a physicist. Uh, I don't know how big we're going to make it, but we're going to go for pretty large. Multi level, nice and big. Don't know how big. Um, Anarith, good evening. How you doing? A uh, an, another another architect in the house, which isn't great when I'm when I'm doing building and stuff like that. That's not what I need. To, <laughs> not what I need to happen. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine. I really should have kept. I can't bother to count. Right. It's one, two, three, four, five. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Right. Um, uh, well, Anarith, we've already rebuilt the bridge um, in the south. So we've already rebuilt the shattered bridge. That, that was our, our first project this evening. We're now building a pyramid. Look at my little legs go, though. Oh, hey, Giz. How you doing, mate? Okay, then we're going to fill this all in. I really hope, I really think... I really think this is square. I'm not entirely sure if I'm honest because I wasn't counting particularly well. I wasn't really paying attention. And everything looks the same. Uh, now, Anarith, this is because I'm using a mod, um, truth be told, which is um, like building restriction reductions. That's the mod. So yeah, that's the idea behind it. But yeah, you, you don't really need to know which way foundations are facing. But yeah, it's the only mod that I'm using, and the reason why I'm using it is because I had some problems placing some things down by the bridge, and I thought it'd be easier for me to do this instead of anything else.
Ah, nice gears. You should be able to do something better. Oh, hang on. This this reminds me. Uh, yeah, we're cloaked. So um, there's there's one of the options in the admin menu that allows you to cloak yourself, which means that wildlife completely ignores you, which is handy when you're building. Oh, exciting times. Try and start citizen. Have you have you bought into it this time? Or are you doing the free fly week? Because the free fly week is actually really I would consider a really good chance to try out some other ships. Um and again it's 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 left me kind of like thinking like, oh I wanna upgrade my ship. Duh. It's like no, don't do it because it's pointless. Oh, you bought into it, you're now a backer. Well, welcome to the I spent money on a game that isn't a game yet club. I remember you and I had it, we, we had this conversation about it. I bought into it, and your, your response was, No, you said we weren't going to do this yet. So, like, yeah, well, I did. And it was an unplayable mess with about 24 frames per second, which, which made for a very cinematic feel, but not very enjoyable. But now it is so much better. Which is interesting considering you think that we watch TV and we we'll watch movies, at least, in 24 frames per second. And that's absolutely fine, but as soon as you're playing a computer game, it's it it's useless, it's totally unplayable. Maybe I should. Oh, you know what? I shouldn't. I, should, I think I went a bit, bit, bit large on the old pyramid, but we'll we'll give it a go. I want to make it so that you can actually go inside the pyramid as well. That's my immediate thought is I want it to be so you can actually go inside and it serves a purpose. It's not just for looks. Because anyone could, I mean, I could just create a, a big square block on top of each other, ever decreasing, and then cover the rest. Don't do that though. Uh, has tech, yeah, it is. Um, like I say it's not a scam; it's just incompetence. And I'm not gonna lie; I think this is this is someone trying to build something out of pure passion and not necessarily make lots of money from it. Uh, I think, and they're making money in the process. And there is a reason why they keep selling ships that you can't get in the game, but then they give you other ships to try out beforehand and all this kind of stuff, which. I mean, there's there's lots of options. Right, we're done. <laughs> That's it. It's done. That's a big square. It's a big square. That doesn't look square. Um, Chica suggested the pyramid. So that's why we've got one. Okay. Now, what I really need to do is find. I'm gonna find the middle. This is um. This is gonna tell us whether it's square or not. If it turns out that I can count, oh my god, I can count. 
Now that that is a miracle. Um, I was <laughs> I honestly wasn't expecting that to work out. Now there is re there is there is a reason why I did this because I, I, I wanted to find the middle because we will need a middle and we will need need some spacing for it to happen because there are you can't build diagonals. Oh boy, this is going this is going to be ridiculous. Yeah, it's um Okay. Yeah, I don't know if I. I mean, Nightbot. It was built by slaves, so <laughs> I don't. I don't. That's my only, my only kind of thought there is that it was uh, definitely built by slaves. Oh, chickens! Here's the thing. I mean, uh, I got time. I'm kind of building myself guidelines. This is what this is. This is all guidelines. The idea being is that it'll um, it will be practical and used. Um, I think. The Egyptians invented Minecraft. They, oh, I don't know, possibly. Um, Trooper, what I'm doing is I am, I mean, more or less kind of spacing things out at this point. Um, I've never built a pyramid before, ever. In this game or in real life, believe it or not, I did not build the ones in Egypt. I know it looks like I did. Because they're all, you know, they're all in disrepair, but it wasn't me. Okay. No, I, we are definitely not doubting that. An RFA. I, I don't think anyone could doubt that they were built. Just that I built them. Well, chickers, I don't know. Um, I mean, I I don't know. They, I mean, they line up with a series of stars as well, don't they? That's the. That's kind of a thing they do. Uh, we need that ramp corner piece. We're going to be using a lot of that. But yeah, we're going to make the shape. And then once we've made the shape, we are going to go from there. Now, one of the reasons that makes kind of sense on this is that the outside of each section of each floor will not be able to be used. And that's kind of it. That's a given. Hmm. Oh no. Oh no. Got a problem. <laughs> Already, we've got a problem. So, 
anyone who's played Conan will, will, will see the issue here. Um, <laughs> is that I? Yeah, it has to be an even number because there is no cap piece. Now, if I were to do it in... Yeah, okay, right. Now, Norith, you're saying I have a cat piece. The issue with the cat piece is is it's, uh, it's spiky. Um... So what I need to do, if we're going to go, all right, we're going to have to go all spiky instead. We'll go all spiky. We're using black eyes, so it, it, we'll use the sloped roof instead. The sloped roof corner piece. Totally fine. You know what? It won't matter. It'll be all right. No, we just it just goes over the top of it. No one will ever know. Can't tell. Can't tell. It, it, it's it's not even noticeable. See? Got it. Nailed it. Nailed it. No one will suspect a thing. Now, of course, the only people that know about that um, is the 28 of you are watching on YouTube <laughs> and three of you watching on Twitch, so no one will ever know about that, so that's totally fine. Um, yeah, chickers. I'm gonna. Like I say I'm putting the the rough structure in place first. And then we're gonna work out the interior after. Um, and obviously this is it's going to seem quite a backwards way of doing this I guess, but it, it makes sense to me because I want to keep it as open on the inside as possible <laughs> yeah, Philip, I know, I know you will know. I will know, which is kind of worse. Not going to happen. I'm not going to be that stupid. 100% going to do it. I'm going to do it in a minute. It's going to make perfect sense when I do as well. I've got a plan. plan. I'm I'm making this up as I go along. Which I think people would come to expect from me by now. And if you haven't I mean, do do you even watch my channel? Ugh. No, the stability checks are all still in place. So it still means that you're 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 stuck with the confines of the building mechanics. So you do have to. The only thing it removes is where exactly you can place things. Uh, 
so you still have to worry about stability. Which I am thinking about as we build. Because what we want to do... Because I've started to think about the interior. With the, uh, I guess, actual pyramids being as something, um, hmm, hang on, that doesn't seem right, that wall is tiny. What do you mean that wall's tiny? You, you're talking about that actual, that, that, that perfectly sized, um, that one meter high can't support a floor three as long. Well, no, an RF, that, that's, that's the actual, that's the game. That's the building mechanics in the game for you. Don't believe me? Give it a go. Um, and actually, I don't want this here. They can't be there. It needs to be there instead. Uh, which means everything gets put back one place instead. Yeah, you can always build three three ceilings out. I'm not saying it's right, just saying that's what you can do. It doesn't it doesn't necessarily make sense. And that should mean we can now fill everything in on this floor. Okay. Um, it's not... <laughs> and also, yeah, because it comes out of it and stuff as well, it's not, yeah. Um, but yeah, and oh, it'd be great to have you back on Conan, man. Um, we, 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 we've, uh, we've learned a lot over the uh, over the years you've been away, and yeah, it's been years. Oh. Um, the one thing that I will say I'm going to have issues with in this is where on earth and how on earth I'm going to transition from floor to floor. Um, or no, chickers. Um, I mean, oh god, I haven't stopped per se. I'm having a, I'm having a rest. That's all. I'm just having a bit, a bit of a break. A trap door. Hmm. Yeah, I, I'm. I'm just having. I'm just having a break. And it. it it's nothing. To, it's nothing to worry about. Oh, wrong bits. We want these ones. Okay, so it means you had to walk in, look around, you're like, oh wow, look at this super cool, super cool space we've got here. And then you'll be like, wow, those pillars look really awesome. And then they won't be in the right place for anyone. And they'll be like, oh, triggered. So we have to put them in. I am thinking of having a lift here that's going to take us straight to the top. Central core stairway. Central core stairway. What kind of around the centre in like a spiral? Because I mean, the very top of it is going to be completely useless. Let's let's be honest. There's not enough space for anything. So let's let's get that capped off. Because 
because that's that's useless really. They can't. It's dead space. Being realistic about it all. Um. Okay. Now we know what that means, don't we? That means we need to have a serious think about. I mean, all of these columns can need to go. Oh, that's fine. That is actually fine. We we can. We can completely destroy them. And this is fine. This is alright. I know I'm doing. This is not my first radio. Cause the top didn't drop. Which I didn't think it would. Um, yeah, first pyramid. I. What? This is going to be a nightmare, isn't it? Okay. Maybe not start there. Maybe don't start there. And you've got to bear in mind that you guys would probably do things differently to me, and that is okay. Yeah. And then there'll be one up from there. Oh, Clive has started. I mean, no, I'm not. What the? What? What the? What the deuce? No, Clive. I don't know why it's doing it. I don't know why it's not. A ha you know what we need? We need a repair hammer because that is going to tell us an awful lot about what's happening. So, I think. Yeah. Right. Stability. Mm, stability. That's interesting. Because technically that's uh it's using the stair uh, it's using the stairs as the anchor point. I think. I think that's what's happening. Yeah it is. So right, it's using the stairs as the anchor point. This is gonna cause problems. This might cause problems. Okay. Be that floor. Gotta start gonna have to start putting the flooring in at least around the, the, the central stairwell I mean to remember to leave space to actually come up as well because the corners don't count Uh, Clive, believe it or not, no one wants to hear you meow that much. Actually, I don't know. Do you guys want to hear him? Because I don't know why you would. Okay. I'm waiting for someone to say, oh, I want to hear it more than you. Like, all right, all right. And then someone will be like, oh, you said it. It's like, damn you. Yeah, Nightbot, thanks. And Clive does give some of the best input, I would say. Uh, he's definitely always got a lot to say. Um, he doesn't give very good informed opinions, if I'm honest. He's... um. Me, or he's a cat, so you can only only expect so much from him. Which he fundamentally disagrees with, I guess. B 
But yeah, this is going alright. I feel like when it comes to building... And yeah, Chick is actually... I guess there might be a part two at this point. Because you could very easily just keep going and keep building and be like, yep, yep, more, more, yep, some more. You know what? Yeah, let's 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 have another floor. Why not? Why why would I not want to have another floor? Um that's all gonna be dead space around the edge, but that's okay. Ooh, that went in where it shouldn't have done. Um, and also, Anarith, if you need uh, any hints and tips on Star Citizen um, when you when you join in, get on the old Discord. Don't just lurk. Be involved, and because uh, you know we actually know our stuff. Yeah, ob observation deck. Oh, yeah, nice. Um, I mean, is this going to be more of a um, a ziggurat? Ziggurat is that a term, isn't it? Or is it a? Uh, or is it a pyramid? Um, no, Clive, you're not an expert when it comes to Egyptian architecture. Right, we don't need this here anymore. Did you know my entire life sounds like a cat meowing? You like seriously, it's um it's what my life sounds like. Um cats cats are very important to different actually, yeah, I mean that that is true. That is true, chickers. I suppose from a certain point of view, maybe Clive thinks this is a uh, a monument to him. Yeah, it's my pet cat, you know, he's not He's not that important. Sort of a hybrid pyramid cigarette again. Now Clive's just shouting because it's close to his dinner time. So don't think he's being abused or ignored or anything like that. It's just not time yet. Oh, but what it is time for is him to go for a poo. Hooray! Because he knows he, he knows when I'm streaming and he knows that's the best time to do it. He's wondering who I'm talking to. Okay, right. Central core is complete. Central core is complete. Nice. <laughs> He's making room. Oh yeah. He's not being verbally abused at all. Okay. Um, I guess we put the floors in extending out. I wouldn't really know what to... What would I... Yeah, that middle bit's going to be difficult. Um... Hey buddy, um, can you be quiet now? Can you do that for me? Because other people's cats get triggered by it, you see? And they try to work out where the sound's coming from, and it's not fair on them. I mean, uh, actually, Clive would have cooked 
in Egypt. <laughs> he would have been no, he would have been a chef, but he would have been like <laughs> ridiculously hot all the time. And I've never seen a cat pant before, uh, but I can tell you for a fact I've only seen it once. Um, and it was Clive, and I was shocked. I was genuinely shocked by it. I, I didn't think cats did that at all. Um, oh no, 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 no! I can't have that there. But yeah, cats when they get too hot pant just like dogs, and it's really worrying. Um, we took it. We, we take him to the vet, and I had to take him uh, actually on on the bus. Uh, one time, and it was summer, and it was pretty awful for him. Now, I know for a fact that the corner is going to be useless up to that point, so we will put these in. It will help kind of, I guess, bulk things out quicker. No, I'm talking to him politely and asking him to be quiet, you see. If you talk politely to animals, they're, they're, they, they calm down, they're super chilled, they understand, they know the tone. And put the entrance one block back so it's recessed. Oh, what? No, Vortex. No. It's going to make sense, I promise I promise you, because that way I can have like a... It's going to be a covered entrance on the way in. I might, I might do that. You are the only one that's mentioned it so far. Oh. Philip agrees. Uh, what about our architects? What do our architects say? Do they agree? It would look better, you were thinking that before. Oh man. Uh, you'd extrude the center of each side. What, so, so it matches, I'm guessing. See, now my thoughts would be, you could potentially have, like, Yeah, Philip, that is right. I, I, I do as I dab well, please. Uh, what about slopes going to sand? Yeah, chickens, I'm gonna... There is a problem with that. Oh, actually, there might not be. I'm trying to think. I, I thought there might be a problem. But no, there actually won't be. I mean, you're making me focus on aesthetics early. I kind of wanted to, fit, to finish the main structure first, but now... But now I've started to do this. There, there is a reason why I normally build function over form. Um, form before function, function before form. Yeah, you see, normally, I say it's normally function. But then again, what I'm what I'm building is like nothing I've ever built before. Oh, and some bits of it you can't even see. Like what? 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 
that's underground. Okay. Um, can you place crenellations on the slopes? Uh, chickens, yes you can. But you've got to remember crenellations can be walked through. And you could probably jump over fence foundations from a defence point of view. Which is probably why this type of thing wouldn't turn up on a live server uh, in PvP. Right. Well, I mean, if you're going to go all feng shui, form and function feng shui is the important bit, I guess, you might want to say. Hmm. <coughs> okay. Small snag. Hidden stuff that you can't see that does serve a purpose. Um, anyone notice the problem with that there? That can't build in that gap. Um, I can't build in that gap. So put a foundation in there. All right, I'm not convinced that's going to help. I'm a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. It won't go in. We're going to use a repair hammer, because in Canon Exiles, a repair hammer allows you to have a look at the stability to see why something may not be able to be placed. Um, stability 75, the foundation, no, the foundation is of course stability 100. Yeah, it, it, really, wa it really was meant to do that. That's exactly what the mod was meant to do. Um, now we'll, we'll come back to that. A strategic statue at each corner. Now, if you were to put one, you'd have to put it like here, like that. This makes no sense. This makes literally no sense. I'm distressed by this. Let's see if that makes a difference. Don't know why it would. Yeah. It'd need to be a big statue, wouldn't it? Build a big patio there with big blocks. Mm. Okay. What we could do because uh, you know what we haven't pulled out yet we haven't pulled out the triangle find foundation blocks yet, which we can get creative with, except I actually can't oh no we can build there so why is that a thing? why is that having problems? It's the only place where I can't build that one little thing there, and I don't know why. Hmm. Yeah, for some reason, there must... But I can build, but I can, like, I can put one there. Now it's failing to place. And also that's um you can't do that. 
type of shape I don't think you what mate <laughs> what? why are they doing this to me what the actual now there isn't a uh, ghost oh hello that's facing the wrong way because I feel like I'd rather have no it's not it just won't go in. This is interesting. Yeah, I mean, things can't snap whilst we're in ghost mode. Oh. It just acts like it's not there. What? Okay. I was kind of hoping this wouldn't happen whilst we're doing whilst we were building today, because that's one of the things that is rather annoying. Yeah, it won't. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Let's um oh. sorted. That made no sense whatsoever. Who knows what happened there? I wonder if I have the same problem over in this corner. Yeah. Yeah, we will. Wicked. Can have the exact same problem. So, how did we solve it last time? Anyone pay attention to that? To, to that particular issue and how we fixed it? Oh, it does that. Okay. Um, take the triangle bit out above. That's right. We did have that bit out. You're right. And we also had that one out as well. And then, it, for some reason, it wants to go in the wrong place. Why does it want to go in the middle there? If only I could copy and paste. All right. We're in a ghost again. We'll drop down below. We're going to take out this one here next to it. Let's just have a little look. It's interesting. I don't realise where thing you don't realise where things are in Conan. Like exactly where things are and where things match up. Okay. We kind of did that, didn't we? And we were in walk mode as well. No, it's not. It's trying to. I feel like it's trying to stick to the... Yeah. <laughs> okay. Alright, we better not have... I think that is it, though. We we're not going to have that on any of the other corners. That's fine. So, we were... everyone's saying that we should have this bit recessed, right? 
it just made no sense. Okay. Show frustration. Alright, get back to flying. Because what we'll need we'll need to put in um, a couple of support struts in here, logically. That would make sense, wouldn't it? Um and what we'll do is we'll have them I mean I guess I could I could have it like there, because that would be the weakest point, wouldn't it? Um, and then from there, well, I can have that going up, can't I? Until the final floor. A final floor reaches. That should be okay. Yeah, vortex. It is exactly like that. It's like that is the perfect spot for a support pillar. Because that means that would actually be the weakest point on all floors going up as well. And of course, this floor wouldn't reach it, and nor would that one. Oh, it's doing weird stuff again. Come on, come on, building. Don't do this to me now. Okay. Um, John, it's that nightbot. This isn't like a Vegas, uh, Vegas casino building. Let's not do that. It's like Caesar's Palace. Nope. 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 Because that's not a pyramid. It's the Colosseum. Um. Yeah, Vortex, they would. No, no, they wouldn't. Okay. And the reason why they wouldn't is because, right, now it's only three out from something with support. Should be. It's like a giant Lego, really. That's the best way of me kind of explaining the way you, you got to look at it. Uh, other. Other building block companies and stuff are available, like Mega Blocks. I mean, you, you know your parents didn't love you when they bought you Mega Blocks as a kid. My parents bought me Mega Blocks as a kid. <laughs> I am only joking. They did buy me Mega Blocks, though. That's not the bit that I'm saying they don't love you about. Mega block. I mean, to be fair, I did have this. Uh, there you go. I had this rocket, this Mega Bloks rocket that was super cool when I was. When I was. I mean, I, I thought it was super cool um, that you could use as a building base and stuff. It was, you know, amazing. 
here we go, 30, 30, 34 year old man talks about building blocks as a kid whilst playing building blocks in a computer game. Oh well. Yeah, so, the interesting enough, the roof pieces actually add support, which is an interesting one. You wouldn't expect them to. <laughs> Nightbot, fantastic. I mean, not, not, not like great that happened, but uh, uh oh, maybe I should just not say anything else really about that. Um, okay, now it's worth pointing out the the reason why we have a T-shaped gap here on this side, and on this side we don't. Is due to the uh, the supports underneath and this particular thing there. Now which side? I don't, um, okay, right. Got some other stuff to think of in this as well. I'm hoping this will be the right place. No, Nightbot, no. Just no. Hmm. I, I don't know where that just went. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh. Misclicks all over the place. This is right. I'm going to have to fill it with stuff now. <laughs> well, um, I think I think Phil and Kirsty would definitely um, approve on that one. No, wait, though, that's not that's that's a different property show, isn't it? Um, I can't remember the name of the guy that does ground designs, but he, he's the guy that does ground designs. It's that guy. But yeah, I was hoping that like this would be a nice chilled out kind of thing to do uh, for for Conan, rather than going bloodthirsty, murdering all over the place. I know people like like seeing me do that, but sometimes it's okay to not be a bloodthirsty barbarian. Not all the time, just sometimes. Okay, this would be uh, the amount of materials this would cost in life would be absolutely obscene. Kevin McLeod, is that right? Um, actually, no, but it was a T-shaped hole in the floor, so we can't have that. And also, it's kind of like that because Conan being Conan when you build in the live servers you typically have to build with defensibility and efficiency in mind because you have people like me who want to blow your base up and take everything that's inside it hmm 
which whilst is the name of the game. Can lead to uh, stress, distrust, and all that kind of stuff. Um, like I told you guys um, the other day, uh, with what happened with some uh, toxic little so and so uh, in the game, telling me to go and uh, get my account or stop sponging off the NHS for my cancer treatment. Um, yeah, a little, a little bit on the toxic side on that. It's one of the reasons why we're not attacking people at the moment. Is because um, I was actually pretty upset about it, so um, offended, like with the right to do so, right to be offended. One of these few times, but yeah, because of that, it's um, and they t and also this is people that raided us, um, and they were being horrible to me. I'm a bit like, well, that doesn't make sense at all. But hey, there you go. I'll have to get rid of that. Yeah, like I said, I'm not um, I'm not sharing the person's name or anything like that. None of that needs to happen because that would just be absolutely awful. Um, but yeah, considering it was just, it's just like, oh my goodness, it's just a game. It is just a game, and there is never any reason to uh, speak to anyone like that. Well, now, why are these going in? Ah, because of the quirks of the building, that's why. Now, also, what I'm thinking as well in this building, whilst we're putting all of this in, we can see it taking shape. I feel as though there should be walls put in, um, like in each 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 one of these bits, like to kind of cover off that section, because uh, from the inside, it's it's looking a little bit, I know, scruffy. Yeah, I mean, going all cucumber on someone. I, I don't really know what that means, if I'm honest. But yeah, I agree, people can be like that. Um, but hey, you know what? It's their choice. Um, if they want to do it, they they can do what they like. I'm not going to... not going to tell people off for it. Not my, not my place. But I am going to tell you, tell you you're a horrible little individual who should maybe get some help. Yeah, see, Haztec it does, and I don't think I don't think I want that. I don't think I want it to be obviously a, done with the roof pieces in that way, because that's like I say, it's dead space. That's important to remember. It's dead space, so it's a ter terrifying first-person sh shooter horror game with necromorphs in. No, it's, it's something a little bit different. Nightclub feel. Definitely no. Definitely not a nightclub. It feels like you'd find a bird, bird's nest or a wasp's nest or something up here and you'd make a YouTube video about it, you know? Because that's what everyone does every time they find stuff. Or it's like a dude finds secret room in his house, has dolls in that he's put there himself and is lying about it, you know? You won't believe what happened next. Is it that someone put a ceiling tile or a ceiling piece in somewhere weird and they need to get rid of it? There's a pyramid cinema in Milton Keynes called The Point. Is there? It's a Cineworld, isn't it? That's the one in uh, 
Milton Kynes. I know it's called Milton Keynes. Okay. We are... Right, we're going to do two sides of it. We're going to finish off the, the, the second side this evening. And I've probably missed an opportunity to put a temple and stuff inside here and all that. I can't bank building a stop for it. Is that like a really unattractive building? A vile pyramid building. Ooh. I just don't know why anyone would... I mean, pyramids are not... They're, they're not practical at all um, to, to have anything in. It's a bit like, I say, loft spaces. They, they're they great if they're extra space, but if they're space that you're kind of relying on, or you're like, oh, yeah, that's a great space. No, it's not. It, it's not a great space. If you've added it, after you've bought a building, bought a property, different story. <laughs> um, hey, greatest, how you doing? Um, I was about to make a really inappropriate joke, uh, which I'm not going to. But he's not. He's not Jesus. He's he, he's being all like um, Zen about it all. Uh, double on glass like the Louvre. Hmm. I mean, I mean, that's kind of like a work of art in itself, isn't it? But woefully impractical. Uh, not only that, he's, he's a bit of a uh, doing some solid construction greatest. Putting those carpentry skills to work. Um, 3 out of 10, not phallic enough. <laughs> Wait, are we talking about the building? I mean, because if... I mean, even if you know, 3 parts out of, out of 10 parts, if your wang looks like this, then you got some problems. Um, is there some method to the madness? Are we talking about the the, the building that I'm making? Um, yeah, I mean the the method to the madness is I'm building a freaking pyramid just just for fun, really. That's what we're doing this evening. Just a, a bit of free building in Conan. Um, yeah, it's yeah. I can't I can't be having this like that. This needs to have walls in. Definitely has to have walls in because it looks bloody ridiculous. Um, Clive? Clive? Buddy, can you come here? Or not. Um, yeah, Clive's gone with the, um, you know, having a dump thing. Which is classic Clive. Yeah, I, it does look very... We're in the attic kind of feeling, so we could either go have it this way round or that way round. Opinions, opinions, opinions. Um, opinions, stone. Um, Gameboy456, you're saying, how do you take 
out if axe when you craft. I don't really know what you mean, Game Boy. I'm afraid. Y you've got me lost there. Alright, stone. Because that way we've got no unpleasant looking Spock. I'm assuming that's where we're going with this, is it? I can't, I can't believe you guys went went and did that. Stain because the other one is a potential fire hazard. I mean, yeah, yeah, I can see why that would be. Um, I I mean, also, it it, it looks better. Oh my goodness, this cat. How do you take out your axes and pickaxes? You just got the game. Um, okay, right, Game Boy. What you need to do is when you've made them, you I'm going to assume you're on PC. You just press the buttons along the top. So you press numbers one, one through eight. Um, you press I to get into your inventory. Um, yes, yes, Clive has put something in there. Um, ah. Uh, yeah, Clive has taken just a, uh, a a huge, massive, massive dump, um, and it smells really bad. So that's what he's done. Um, yeah, what to do about them? I know I need to have those pillars there. That they, they have to, they have to be there. I don't know why one of them would suddenly be the wrong way around. Oh yeah, quick reminder to everyone that hasn't already. Um have a cheeky cheeky click of the like button. Um as you guys know, it does help me out. It's a free way of showing support for the channel. No one gets hurt in the process, I promise. Yeah, vortex. I don't I don't know about that. Um what I would do because part of me is like hmm, well I could do something different um, I mean pillars could be boxed in but I'm fine with the pillars as they are, they look okay um, ooh. But yeah, those corn those corners. Um, I I don't like the fact there's a gap. I mean, I could technically put walls over them because you can layer up, and I think that looks slightly better than just having the gaps in. So that's something to consider. Um, but the tier three side of the white beam come out the point of the pyramid. That would chickers that would be cool. Um, unfortunately, there's going to be no doing that now. So yeah, we'll probably put the layer up, layer up, because you know layers are cool. I mean, the other thing that I could do is now we're at this point. I can actually replace bits, and I already, I, I having done this, I'm, I could have done something completely different, um, and should have done. Uh, ghost under it, over there, or hidden. Uh, you can't put stuff down in ghost mode, though. It's not an option. Uh, 
Um, uh, chickers, there's no way to get it to the center point though, because in the, in the very center is where we have the stairs. Unless I were to um, go down, switch to fly, then you can play stuff. Hmm. Right. Well, we'll, we'll, have, we'll have a look. We'll have a look. Must admit, this is already uh, taken longer than I thought it would. I really should have seen this coming. Because I'm now all about the aesthetics. That's it, it's what we're all about. Ah, oh, Nightbot. <laughs> uh, thank you very much, dude. Much appreciated. Yeah, may maybe next time I will get a dude in instead. It, it might might work better for me. It might be a smart move. Oh, did not want to put that there. I want to get a change. Yeah, a little bit louder. Okay. Right, next floor up. Okay, what I was actually thinking is what I should have done is have this here. Okay, I'm gonna hopefully and done that instead. So you can actually get all the way around. Let you see what I've done. Um. It's done that, which should offer the same level of support for the tower. And now, now I wish that I'd done that. That would have made a lot more sense, wouldn't it? Opinions. Although I'm pretty sure there's going to be no way to no way to completely replace everything now, because the the lower ones should be fine. But as soon as we this this side here, this would cause the entire side to crumble. All right, Alien Hunter saying leave it as is. Nightbot saying I won't like it. Okay, it would look more open. Just do the corners. Um, that doesn't make I don't, that doesn't make sense, chickas. Uh, put in supports next to it and then remodel. Hmm. Yeah, that would be better. Actually, I could leave the central columns. Because I quite like the central columns where they are. They kind of make sense. Um, so I could do that up until this point here. Hmm. Right. I'm going to finish off the inside before we before we go and we, we restructure and we remodel everything. That's probably a mistake. Um, Killer Kev, I am floating around because I am doing some free building in Conan, and it's the most efficient way to get around. Um, basically, they give you the option to be able to float. 
And who wouldn't want to float whilst holding yourself in a bit of a zen position? Hello there. Uh, Cemetery Warrior, thank you very much for subscribing. Um, I mean, do, do you go to graveyards to fight at night? A bit Buffy the Vampire Stay Slayer style? Or how, how does that work? I'm, I'm genuinely, genuinely intrigued. So we're almost done. And of course, you do the whole thing all over again. Well, that would take us through most time. I might even put the walls in first. Uh, it's not taking out every other large column and replace it with a small one. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Found a gap. Okay. Oh, found. Found more gaps. Blame it. Done. Um, I mean, easier access is okay, um, but then, I mean, do I do I want easier access? Is that something that we want? Well, this is this is a uh, how I'd do the top here. Let's make it a little bit spiky, but without there being an obvious way in. Maybe, maybe not the top one. Bottom one, yeah. Top one, no. Um, Anthony, yeah, yeah, you can. Um, I'm I'm a fan of elevators in it. Big fan. Um, I I find them. Especially because you know, I go out collecting stuff and you get super over encumbered. So yeah, you're horizontal and you're vertical, which is all very nice. But yeah, that's um, that is a a big old pyramid. That's the back of my head. Um, Killer Clown, does anyone know if they asked me to to be the next Lucifer? I mean, I'd do it. I mean, that sounds like sounds like everlasting life. If there was one, I'd do it. <laughs> sure, well, why not? Or are we talking about the TV show? Because no, they didn't. And they really should have done. They do a great job. Yeah, I'm not. I don't. I know. You know. I don't think I like the way that looks in the corner. I think we're gonna be we're gonna leave it as it is. Yeah, I think. I think that'd be my preference. Maybe I should have had doors in every single one. 
every single side. I think that would have been Um, well, Killer Clown, I think we all have, to be honest. Um, I've had a little bit of a break because there's been really kind of no choice but to have a break because there's not been a huge amount to do. I don't think any of us have uh, um, had much. Uh, we want these because I, I want to kind of do a bit of a this is what this would look like, this is how we'd do this and um one entrance is better than they, all those secret exits of like mm, no. Don't I don't need to I don't need to worry about I don't need to worry about defensibility, you just need to worry about cool factor, you see. That's what we're going for, cool factor. Which I'm aware I'm playing a computer game. Um and streaming it on a Friday night and that's not the coolest thing in the world to do. It's alright. Chickers, no, I, I don't need, I, I don't need a dragon to come and look at this place. I could just spawn one in if I wanted to, if I were so inclined. But you know what? I'm okay with having a dragon-free abode. Oh no, 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 no! This is this 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 will never do. These are all in the wrong place. No, no dra I don't need I don't need dragons. <laughs> I'm like I don't I don't need them. But what we do need is torches on as many surfaces as possible because that is always a good idea. Lots of light. I whenever I build a base, lighting is the last thing that I put in. And Chickers knows this because he plays Conan with me, and he will tell you I never ever put lighting in. And it gets to the point where it's like, a, I can't see anything in here, someone has to do something. And I'm like, meh, could do. But I'm just not going to. Nah, don't worry about it. Well, yeah, reverse psychology is a good one. I mean, cats are kind of like dragons. Like, they only pre they only pretend they're going to do what you've asked them to. The rest of it is going to possibly set you on fire. Maybe eat your face. The usual stuff that dragons and cats will do. Okay. I would have this there. What is we will switch it over to night time in a minute, I think. And we'll see what it looks like at night time. Because I've frozen time in order to make building easier. Yeah, no spoilers on the channel though. 
no spoilers on the channel. Um, Game of Thrones, absolutely freaking epic. Um, I'm enjoying this season, knowing it's the final season. There's a bit of a, a bit of a bummer, but still very, very good. Well, no, it wouldn't be worth it. Instant ban. 100% instant ban. That's what I'd do. Ooh. Okay. I have to put one on that side. Um, yeah, only thing you have to take is that you can't attach them to the outside of the building. Oh. I've got kind of they only attach to flat surfaces. Which is one of the reasons why I wanted the entrance on the outside. Just saying. Torches on. The only place we could add torches would be actually yeah. There. And there. Okay. Uh yeah, Killer Clown, she's she's twenty one. So <laughs> I kind of think that's where you're going with that, um, but say no more. Okay, we are going to set it to uh, time of day. We're going to set to. I'm going to see that. Is that night time? I think that's pretty night time ish. Looks nice and well lit from the inside. That's dark, isn't it? That is not light enough at all. That helps. Oh dear. This is, um. It's kind of dark in places. But now I, I like the top. We've got the entrance that is lit still. But yeah, I think that's going to be called quite a good stopping point for the stream for this evening. Um, We've made some really, really good progress on this. Uh, what we'll do is we'll have a quick kind of review over what we've done, I guess, or, or things that we have made on the stream before we call time. Wait for the sky to catch up. But there we go. So, you can see we've got the awesome Pyramid of Doom that we've made so far, which is all very, very nice. Um, I'm going to continue to work on this one on stream and get it kind of finished off and then um, move on to the next project that'll be but yeah very, very happy with that idea so Chickas thank you very much for the suggestion um, also what we have worked on today has been rebuilding the shattered bridge which we have done So yeah, we have rebuilt the shattered bridge so it's no longer shattered, and we have 
basically, yeah, rebuilt the bridge of doom. I don't know if it needs to be of doom, but but this is this is what it looks like from end to end. Did did not press an attack button. Kind of thought God Mode would give you a. Uh, At least more more stamina, but yeah. So, see, big old bridge. See, immediately this compared to the um, compared to what we've been building is is a bit bit naff. But yep, King Scourge statue, very very nice. So we run through. I mean, it doesn't really add any convenience whatsoever to the game. Like the bridge. Being damaged is it's built around the bridge being damaged. That's how the map's been built. But yeah, this is a, a land ruled by Commander Plater. That's me. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, yeah, now I remember. Now I remember why that was like that. That is because I can't remove this piece. Because this piece is stuck. Right. It's fine. Totally fine. I'm sure a relog will fix it when we get there. But yep, got the, got the bridge. And they come down, got the stairs, and hey, da da, we're in the exiled lands. It's all great fun. Nothing tries to kill you here. That's a lie. Everything tries to kill you. It's got a glowy thing there. This is alright. Looks fine. But yeah, so that's what we've done today, which is alright. So I'm going to call time for the stream there, guys. So as usual, I'm going to encourage everyone to make sure that you hit the like button on the way out. Make sure that you uh, subscribe on YouTube if you haven't subscribed already. Same time, also make sure that you follow on Twitch. If you haven't followed on Twitch, um, and I'll likely stream over the weekend with a spot of Elite Dangerous, um, as we haven't played some of that for a while. But okay, guys, I'm going to say once again thank you uh, very much for watching. Commander Plater, out. <laughs>